15. Mickey Quinn a prolific forward. Mickey Quinn was undoubtedly rotund by football standards. His own fans created the chant. He is fat. He is round. He scores at every ground. 14. Andy Wigley has spent eight seasons in the Premier League and currently plays for Nottingham. Forced in the championship. Naturally stocky. Reed has at times simply been overweight. 13. Ronald a Brazilian striker was near unplayable in his teens and early 20s. But a constant battle with weight followed him throughout his career. One of the all-time greats himself is now regularly referred to simply as Fat Ronaldo. 12. Kevin Pressman Kevin Pressman had a 22-year career, with 17 of those years spent at Sheffield Wednesday, where he played over 500 games. 11. Neil Ruddick did play for England, winning a solitary cap in a 1994 friendly against Nigeria. At club level, Ruddock? As most significant spells came with Southampton, Tottenham, Liverpool and West Ham. 10. Diego Maradona Diego Maradona was always a stocky individual. But persistent drug use from the mid-1980s onward contributed to weight gain later in his career. And into his retirement. 9. Ferenc Puskas Ferenc Puskas is quite rightly regarded as one of the finest players and most gifted forward the game has ever seen. Towards the end of his career Puskas was heavily overweight, but still virtually unplayable. 8. Steve McNulty McNulty has go technique for a defender, but his mobility surely has to be called into question such as his size. Age 32. McNulty is currently on loan at Tranmere Rovers from Luton Town. 7. Thomas Brolin after the 1994 World Cup. Thomas Brolin was hot property in Europe. When he joined the Leeds United in 1995, Brolin had failed to recover from an injury and was hideously unfit. Retired at 28. 6. Jerome Verhoeven Dutch shotstopper Jerome Verhoeven began his career at Ajax. In the club, S legendary academy, renowned for his incredibly large waistline, Verhoeven is no stranger to taunts and abuse from opposition fans. 5. Adrian Nodriano had all the tools to become a world-class center forward. His character, fitness and work rate were all called into question. And recent photos of the former Brazil star expose how serious this problem are. 4. Neville Southall a truly world-class goalkeeper. Southall is an Everton legend, who spent 17 years with the Toffees. Southall was a large man, and towards the end of his career he was severely overweight. January 3rd Mulby with fine technique and passing ability. Mulby had an excellent career but was often stocky, and as he reached his 30s his weight began to become a real issue. 2. Ailton standing at 5 foot 8. Ailton was very bulky. For the most part, he used his strength to his advantage. But his weight fluctuated and at times he was simply fat. 1. William Falk William Falk was so renowned for his weight that he was more famously known by the nickname Fatty. It is even suggested that the first time Great All the Pies was ever heard. It was being directed at the 24ST goalkeeper.